OPPD says it needs more money to continue the level of service as we know it. So today, the district board, board rather approved a rate hike. About $7.31 for an average household. And two things are playing into this. The startup and recovery and the cost of Fort Cajon Nuclear Power Station and a reduction in sales. It's one more increase to our utility bills. John Chapman is on the story and joins us via Six View Live. We are in Midtown and beginning January 1st, it will cost more money to keep these lights on and the lights in our homes. And that concerns people who live on fixed incomes because their bills keep going higher. If a senior citizen like me... Marty Brown is a retired accountant. Today, he found time to give officials at OPPD his opinion on the upcoming rate increase. Brown told officials he's on a fixed income, and he can't believe he's about to take another hit. Green. Yes. McGuire. Yes. But the board voted unanimously to pass the rate increase. Now back home, Marty goes over his expenses. He says Social Security will give him an extra $21 but half of that increase will be spent on the basics. Just two utilities alone represent 49% of the increase Social Security people are going to get this coming year. We haven't been able to catch up senior citizens. Mm -hmm. So that's one of the things that I, I look at because people wonder where their money is going. And it's because of utilities, because of food and gasoline and all those are, is causing senior citizens to cut back. Marty is a member of Nebraska Taxpayers for Freedom. He says all the extra costs begin to pile up, and a little more here and a little more there will keep most seniors trying to relax at home. You don't go out to eat that often. You don't go to see your grandkids as often. Uh, you don't buy uh, nicer things. You settle for generics rather than the top-of-the-line product. OPPD says even with the increase, their rates are still below the regional and national average. Reporting live, John Chapman, Channel 6 News.